Hello to you and welcome. Pumpkins are taking center stage here on the Southern Table as we are so excited to share with you a timeless fall project for any space in your home. We love any excuse to mix in a pumpkin in our centerpiece. We've done many versions of this before. In fact, the last time we hollowed out our pumpkin, took off the top, yeah. put the flowers in, and it was a mess, y'all. So we have changed the game, if you will, and found a mess-free way to do this. And we are obsessed with this project and we hope you will be as well. Well, you're going to start by picking out some beautiful pumpkins, and we started at Ingalls. Boy, they've got you covered for the heirloom pumpkins. We love this color. This color is divine yes. this season. And we also grabbed some just traditional pumpkins and carving pumpkins to pull this project I love together. it. They have them at all price point size, so whatever project you're looking for. And okay, the flowers. we got to talk about the flowers. We love any excuse to go to the Ingalls Markets Floral Department. And depending on the size or scale, we wanted to let you all know exactly how many you'd be using. Right. So for this project, obviously a bigger pumpkin, we've used two of the bundles from the Ingalls Floral Department. Those will cost you anywhere between $20 and $30. So this project is under $60. Bucks. Wow, that's amazing. That it would really cost is. a lot more if you went somewhere else. And if you're doing a smaller version, these are the three for 10 bundles. You can find them at the end capsule of the cooler right Love there in these. the flowers. And again, inexpensive and easy project that you can put together in less than 15 minutes. And we love this for any space in your home. How cute is so this? Cute. Okay, first we're gonna get those pumpkins nice and clean before we begin to give a great clean foundation for our project. We were laughing, they're coming from the farm. We gotta get those germs <laughs> and dirt off of them. But truly, just give them a bath in your sink, plop them in there with a little soap. Right. It's gonna allow them to last longer, Yes. getting all that off of them so they don't rot quickly. Yes, that's step one. Step two, you're gonna head to your craft store and get some floral oasis. This stuff is a miracle yes, and a lifesaver. Yes, we love saver. these for centerpieces. So easy. So dunk that in some water. And for the larger scale pumpkin, we're using a full piece of Oasis and we're attaching that with some barbecue yes. skewers. Just poke those straight in. To secure it in and place. And then you can break those off so that your flowers easy hide the easy. mess, but it gets it nice and secure. Right. And if your pumpkin has a stem, it's going to be easy for you as well because you can just place that Oasis right over top of it. Now do right. take your time so the Oasis doesn't split. But then from there, it's just simply building oh. your flower arrangement. And this is where you can get really yes. creative. Cut your flowers down to size. Make sure on the larger pumpkins you have some going both up right. and down vertically and some spillers that come out of the front. So pretty. This is such a fun project and it would be a good girls, girls night. Girls night. We're planning a party and y'all are invited. <laughs> but look how easy this goes in love there. It. You can create these quickly. We love it. Hey, love you it. can check out this project and others by heading to southerntableshow.com. And remember, there's always a place for you. At the Southern Table, presented by Ingles. We'll see y'all next time.